Pakistan is an important country for the United States. It's strategically located, it's big, you know, it has the sixth largest army in the world, has enormous economic potential, particularly on the agricultural side, also minerals and so on. Um, uh, educated population, English speaking, um, you know, located between South Asia, Middle East, and so on, borders China, Iran. Global Village Space this summer sat down for an exclusive discussion with a prominent South Asia expert, Robin Rafael. Robin has been an American career diplomat for over 40 years. She first came to Pakistan in 1975 with her husband, Arnold Rafael. He later died in the 1988 famous air crash along with General Zia most famously depicted in Muhammad Hanif's novel, A Case of Exploding Mangoes. You know, Pakistan sort of fell behind, I think because in large part, or at least in a significant part, because of the wars in Afghanistan, the promise of the 70s got sort of stopped short. She has served as the US Ambassador to Tunisia, Assistant Secretary of State for South and Central Asian Affairs, and as the coordinator for non-military assistance to Pakistan, carrying on the work of Richard Holbrook. Pakistan had, um, uh, you know, uh, had a lot of promise as a developing country at that time. In light of the stress relations between the two countries, we asked her what Pakistan really needed to do to deepen relations with the US, and what was this Afghan policy all about? I, I think this whole uh, transactional versus strategic relationship uh, division is, is a bit of a red herring. I mean, you know, countries' relationships with others, other countries are, are based on their own self-interest, ultimately. Oh. Yeah.